So this week we decided to make custom kites, but not without the help of Cardo's way. Who went on and cut the bamboos for us. He carved the pieces for us, shaped the kite for us, and then even pasted the bags for us. Hold on, did we actually do anything? <laughs> he does have a YouTube channel, Cardo's Way, where he does a lot of outdoor activities and other stuff. Go check him out. Link will be in the description and enjoy the rest of the video. Almost there. Here we go. Now that the bamboo is cut, we went to the store to get the rest of the supplies. Look, there's this kind. That's really thick though, huh? Wait, let me see, let me see, let me see. I think it's this one. Look at this. One of those. One of these? Yep. Look at, this is up to 40 pounds. That looks good. You didn't even look. Talk about I'm looks good. It looks good. <laughs> And that one's it's, um it's, because this one's too small, right? It's a small amount. No, it's a smaller amount, but it's the same thing. Three packs? No, no, no. We don't need the three go. packs. Oh, here, we right need, here. These are the ones we need. Oh. Let's make yeah. sure that it's the square. Um, it's a rectangle. Yeah, bags are rectangle. Once it's not circle, like right, these so just, right here. Okay. See, they so have all the are... pretty colors, but they are circle, circle, circle. How many do we need? I mean, y'all choose the color. What color do you want? Gold. I mean, green. The green. This is the green right here. It's this lime green. All right. Okay. So we just need one. That's a square. Yeah. That, 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 okay. that is gold. Everybody love me. Now back at the house, Cardo has started cutting the bamboo and this is the first start of making this kite. Do the hand cut off like we enough of them do. The hand cut off of that. So alright, the final piece, we're about to get ready. And here are all the supplies we need to make this kite. We have the bamboo that Cardo has already cut, this welded wood contact cement glue, plastic table covers, and rope. Now let's get this process started. You want 
get where you think it's the middle and you want to start working in the middle. Then you open it and get it tight. As you can see here, Cardo is using four pieces of the bamboo to construct the framing of the kite, almost in the shape of a hexagon. Here he's just trying to make sure that everything is even. Here he is making slits in the bamboo to hold the rope. This, my friends, is the framing completed. Now, on to the next step of covering the frame. For this one, we made a personal NNK's kite. Here he is outlining the letters. Two thousand years later. Mm. Smells awesome. First, before we put the coverings on, you need to moderately place the glue.
let it smile for the like half it. So then I'm like, why the fuck is it as straight as possible? Keep their hands up, let my hand go down, keep their hand up. Keep their hand up. Much, Start going down with your hand, keeping it wide. And now you need to cut the excess plastic. You need to keep about a half an inch or so so you can fold the plastic over for the glue. We had extra material, so the only thing we could do is make another kite. This is not recommended. This leads to mistake 90% of the time. But because the razor blade got dull, so I just have to cut that one piece off. Yeah, I work for the tin. Here we have the final touch of adding the NNK's logo.
here they are, the two custom made kites. One star and one personalized. Now to see if they will fly. Stay tuned for the next kite video to see how they do. As always, we appreciate you watching the NNKs. Thank you.